Hello, and welcome back to another episode of e-reading. My name is Elvin, and today I'm reading Bad Dog by Mike Bolt. This is another entry this year into the Blue Spruce Award. Uh, it's another nominee in the Blue Spruce Awards, which again is our Provincial uh, Library Association's Award uh, for uh, books uh, to highlight uh, this year for early readers is the Blue Spruce one. Uh, the links will be in the description to the program, uh, just the other books that I will be reading most of. So, uh, Bad Dog, there is a cat in the front. Um, so maybe there's a bad dog that fights with the cat. I'm not sure. Let's find out why this dog is so bad. Bad Dog by Mike Bolt. Look what I got for my birthday! A pet dog! My dog has black and white fur, pointy ears, and a cute little nose. Her name is Rocky, and she is a bad dog. Rocky doesn't listen like good dogs. Hey Rocky, come. Aw, oh, come on. You can do it, Rocky. Come here, girl. See, Rocky is a bad dog. Good dogs like to go for walks, but not Rocky. And Rocky really doesn't like other dogs. She is great at climbing, though. Bad dog, Rocky, come down! Rocky doesn't listen. She is a bad dog. I am teaching Rocky some tricks that good dogs do. Sit, Rocky. Stay. Rocky, fetch. Rocky, roll over. Shake a paw. Hmm. Rocky is not a good dog. But Rocky isn't all bad. Rocky doesn't bark when the mail is delivered. And Rocky doesn't have accidents on the floor. She doesn't chew on my toys either, though she does like to play with my shoelaces. Hmm, what else does Rocky like? Rocky likes to sleep in the sun and sleep on Dad's chair and sleep on Mom's clothes. Rocky really likes to sleep. I thought Rocky liked to play in the water. But she is not a fan of bath time. Come down, Rocky! See, Rocky still doesn't listen. She is a bad dog. With black and white fur, pointy ears, and a cute little nose. You know what? I think Rocky would make a pretty great cat. Well, most of the time. The end. Well, I hope you enjoyed that reading of Bad Dog. I certainly did. Um, wonderful art, uh, but also a really good message, I think. I think it's a silly book. Uh, great for kids to really think about why this cat is such a bad dog. Uh, but I think the message that I took from it was really how, you know, we can judge people and, and try to think whether people are good or bad based on the wrong things and not what they are. The girl kept thinking that she had a bad dog, but she had actually had a really good cat. And she sort of realized that at the end, or maybe she thought she did, or she, she didn't realize it entirely. Uh, but that's kind of the lesson that I took from it. It's a great book, uh, another worthy entry into the Blue Spruce Awards uh, nominees. And let's see if they win or who wins. I don't know if do people win. Not too sure. But this was a great book, Bad Dog by Mike Bolt. So that actually is the bad dog. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed this book. Uh, and if there are any others, please go to the monthly roundup video. Uh, there you can leave some comments for me on other books uh, that I can read. I'd love to hear from you and, and hear your suggestions. Uh, but until next episode, be gentle and kind with one another. Bye now.